Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park. So we are located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota RAV4 XLE. Now the most notable features on this XLE is its power moonroof. You also have your power lift gate along with your heated steering wheel. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota RAV4 XLE. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this XLE is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps. Taking a closer look, just over on the side you have your 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels. You also have your integrated signal lamps as well as your foldable mirrors. And then if we take a look on the inside of the mirror, you'll see your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with that blind spot monitoring indicator, it actually light up just looking at there's another vehicle right beside you. You have the smart key system with it, so with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle. Push on once, it'll lock all the doors automatically, and then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now if you hold it there a little bit longer, it'll actually open up all the doors for you as well. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is blue. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black cloth into your seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Over on your left hand side you're going to see your automatic headlights as well as your window wiper de-icer, heated steering wheel and your power lift gate release. On the inside of your driver's side door you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function, back, Bluetooth, volume control, voice recognition, lane departure alert, cruise control, mode select, and seek function. Now it does have that push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now taking a look at the multi-informational display, you have a digital speedometer with the exterior temperature gauge and digital clock. But you also have that distance to empty, and you can also take a look at your lane departure alert with your trip info, all-wheel drive, settings menu with your lane trace assist, pre-collision system, blind spot monitoring on and off, rear cross traffic alert, and a couple of other additional features. Finally, you'll finish with your messages menu. And taking a look now at your center dash as well as your touch panel display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So inside the menu screen, you'll see your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features. With that apps menu, it's part of the Entune app suite. So as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Scout GPS app, which allows you to stream your maps from your phone onto the touch panel display. You can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores. You have your hazard lights, temperature control settings for your dual zone climate control, traction control off, heated uh, seat control, sorry, for your driver and passenger. You have your power outlet with your USB and auxiliary input, matted to a automatic transmission with your eco normal sport mode, and then you have your snow, mud, sand, rock, and dirt feature. Now at the top you have your open and close as well as your tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof with the sunglass case holder. And I'm just going to throw this into reverse just so I can show you what the backup camera looks like. But as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you back into a stall. But you can also change up the backup camera view to a more dynamic view or the traditional backup camera view you're used to. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located just on your left hand side, you're going to see your backup camera and your rear hatch release located underneath your Toyota emblem. All you have to do is push on the button once and it will open up for you automatically. Taking a closer look just in the rear cargo space, you have the cargo cover in the back which is nice because you can cover up your valuables just before going from place to place. The other nice thing is you do have a 60-40 split for your rear seat, so you just have to pull on one of the two tabs that you see on either side there. And if we take a look underneath the floor, you'll find your spare tire as well as your jack and tool kit, so if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. The other nice thing is that you can actually flip this piece over just in case the cargo that you are hauling is a little bit rougher on the carpet side. And then you can actually lower this down a little bit farther just in case the cargo that you are hauling sits a little bit higher up and you need that little bit of extra space. The other thing I like is that you do have the power adjustable tailgate, so all you have to do is push on the button for approximately two seconds of the height you'd like it at. It'll beep a couple of times, then when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to this height. 
Now if you want to reset the height for yourself, hold down the button for more than 4 seconds. It'll beep several times, so when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to the maximum height for you. A couple of the uses for that power tailgate is if you're a little bit shorter or if your garage is a little bit lower, you can prevent the back of your tailgate from being damaged. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.